Hey, what's up everyone? So, today I have Pokemon Celebrations ETB. So, I decided to open this up. I do have uh, the... Uh, there was a pre... not pre-order. There was some more stock at the Pokemon Center for the... Uh, Elite Trainer Box for Celebrations. And there was... those are the ones that are stamped uh, uh, the Pokemon Center. So, because I have those coming, uh, well, I got two of them because I want to hold on to one of them. An open one. So this one here I got from Best Buy. I want to open this one up because I have another case coming. So I have three of these now. That's too much. And so I don't want to hold on to all this product. This is too much stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm opening this up and then we'll see what we get. Uh, but yeah, this is trainer box here. It's pretty cool. Let me see if I have it in the back here. That's in the back there. Because um, normally Best Buy has a little sticker they put on here. It has all your information in it. Your name, your where you got it from and blah, 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 blah. So anywho, oh man, this is going to be pretty awesome pack openings. How many are there? There's 10. Celebration packs. So oh, this is why Elite Trainer Boxes are the best. The, the best. Uh, five additional uh, booster packs. So I'm hoping we get one of each on these. Chilling Rain, uh, Ballast Up, Vivid Vulture, Darkness of Blaze, and hopefully not another Darkness of Blaze. Actually, we might not have Vivid Vultage. Uh, one special for Grand Ninja. So this one here is going to be pretty dope. Uh, the sleeves here, we're going to check the sleeves out. Hopefully, the sleeves are pretty good. Uh, but to be honest, though, I don't think I would use the sleeves. Maybe if I open up another one. But I don't want to use these, open these, because these is more for collectible items. A lot of the stuff is actually all collectible items. A lot of the 25th anniversary is all just stuff that they bought back. And so, but the dice looks pretty cool, though. Let's uh, open this up and let's see what we can get out of here. Um, so, let's just open this, open this, cut that open. Uh, yeah, so I am pretty excited to open this up. Uh, I did open up uh, the Celebration Dark uh, Sylveon V. I got some Team Rocket stuff in there, which is pretty awesome because I honestly think it's because I read that little story, a pamphlet about Dark Sylveon, and it just gave me all of the <laughs> the Team Rocket stuff. You know, I didn't get the Impulsor uh, Professor Oak, but I actually don't mind because it gave me a bunch of other stuff. It gave me the uh, the Zapdos. The uh, what else did it give me? I forget, but I'll put it up on here. Oh, Dark Gyarados. There we go. Dark Gyarados, the Claydol, and also the Flying Pikachu. So, it gave me those. Oh, let's open this up. We have to open this and look at this. Uh, is anything in here? Oh, there's nothing really inside here. So, there's no real artwork that they have like the other uh, ETBs, which is unfortunate. It's just kind of a thing. And then, I believe, I'm pretty sure the little... These are just like a background here. Yeah, this is a bunch of, just a repeat of all the Pokemon, I believe. Yeah, it's a repeat. I saw Bulbasaur twice. Cool. So we have that. Let's look at this uh, book here, the Place Guide. So let's see what's inside the Celebrations Pack. Let's go through this. So we did get the, one of these, uh, the dogs here. Zasha and Zama, Zama Zeta V. We did get a lot of Cosmo. We got this one here. I actually don't mind seeing this one. That one be cool. Ooh, this one looks really awesome. If we can get the Luna la. That'd be sick. This Pikachu here, I think we got this one. That one's almost super, super common. The Charizard though, that one's pretty sick. Ooh, this looks fair. looks pretty awesome too. Wow, Mewtwo EX is inside here. Tapu Lele is in here. That's pretty cool. The Rayquaza, I haven't got that one yet. This one's pretty sick though. I actually might get this one here. It's Luxway. That's pretty dope. That's a dope card. And then we also get the special Greninja. And then we got a new combo with the kick. Alright, we got these two there. Dialga, Bronzong. Uh, hopefully Bronzong not in here. I, I would not like to have that card in there. Um, so these are just different ways to combine cards. Got to end there already. Um, all right, four cool cards to celebrate. We got Mew, Professor Research. We just uh, we got this one earlier. Uh, Flying Pikachu. We haven't had a certain Pikachu yet. That'd be cool to see. And here is the card list. So I know we got a bunch of uh, of these four up here: Pakia, Kyogre, Restaurant, Ho. Uh, I think we got this one. I don't know if we got these Pikachu's yet. Um, Another birthday one is one of the ones that they people were saying is pretty rare, but a lot of people have been getting them, like pretty frequent. Um, we got Yadalto, we got Groudon, Dialga, um, Professor Research. Ooh, we didn't get the full art one though. This is one we need. 
We got Sogea, Sogalio. I remember seeing that name. Lugia. Ooh, the dark. We got a gold Mew. Imposter Professor Oak. That one's pretty cool. We got the dark Gyarados. We need a dark Team Rocket there. Dark. They're already dark. Rocket Zapdos. That one was pretty sick card. I'm glad I pulled that one. We got a Clay Doll, which I'm eh, no, okay with it. Shiny Magic Card would be pretty dope. And then the Umbion Star. This one here. This is the one I want. I gave a nephew that one, so. Ooh, these ones are pretty sick too. I might get one of these guys too. Is that called Man Restaurant? These guys just came out on Pokemon Go, so I've been catching them. Well, the, the, the lady's been wanting me to catch a bunch of Zekrons, so we've been fighting Zekrons like, like crazy. Every time she sees it, let's battle it. Let's take it down. And so, yeah, we've been playing a lot of uh, Pokemon Go, taking and collecting uh, capturing Zekrom. I do need to get a shiny. Oh, yeah, so that's it. Uh, that's pretty cool. Let's set that aside. And let's open this box here. Um, let's turn it around. This is a pretty much basic player guide. I have so many of these. This is one of the things that it's unfortunate. A lot of stuff does get trashed that I just tossed out. Like that player's guide. Uh, the energy in here, too. It's a stack of energy. I have so many of these. I don't know what to do with these. I do need to find out what I'm going to do. Alright, so we have these dividers. So this is pretty cool. I thought it was just a white divider, but it's... It's a bunch of uh, it's, it's what's in the uh, inside of the uh, of the uh, the cover for this uh, ETB. It'd be cool if they were all different Pokemon's though, um, instead of just the same card. That would be pretty awesome. But it's the same one, which is understandable. It's nice though. It feels nice. I like these dividers. Pretty cool. Uh, let's move the pack. Let's take the packs out actually. Uh, let's see what packs we got. We got Chilling Rain one. Two packs of Chilling Rain. Okay, that's pretty cool. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hey, where's ten? Wait, 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 wait. I'm supposed to get ten. Yo, did I just get gypped? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I did get gypped. Oh, uh, one. Oh, wait. Nine. All right, nine, ten. Oh, gosh. I thought I got gypped, yo. Okay, I was like, where is it at? Oh, you know what? This is... I don't mind this because we got a bunch of chill main packs instead of battle styles and uh, darks and blades and one baby voltage so I don't mind that that's actually uh, not too bad but all right cool we got 10 packs that's what we're looking for 10 packs let's count them again just to make to reassure one two three four five six seven eight nine ten packs okay 10 packs I was gonna say did we just get a box error oh man that would suck and what's inside here? The code card. Code card for you. Y'all can get the code card for this Lee Trainer Box. And in here is the Grin Ninja. Cool, cool card. Grin Ninja Star. So it's a promo. That's pretty cool. Sword and Shield uh, 114. Sorry, 144 promo. So it's for the Sword and Shield. You can't have more than one Pokemon Star in your deck. Wow, is it because it's that strong? Uh, Poke Power. So when you play this Pokemon from your hand onto your bench during your turn, you may put one damage counter on one of your opponent's Pokemon. Uh, when you play this card from your hand onto your bench, hmm. I wonder if there's a way to get your heart, your, your, your Pokemon card, your Pokemon's off the bench, like on and off the bench, easily. Yeah, it's okay. Miss Slash, this, this attack damage isn't affected by weakness or resistance. Or by any effects of the opponent's active Pokemon. Hmm. Why is it? Why is it only one 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 card of these? Is it because you're flexing too much? Oh, that's pretty cool. We'll put to the side there. And what else is inside here? Uh, all right. So I think that's it. Oh wait, we got the, the poison counter, like we always do. And we got the damage counter. So these damage counters are all white. I think that's pretty cool. They look kind of like teeth though, which is kind of a uh, kind of kind of weird. I don't know. After I said that, all I'm seeing is teeth now. Teeth, teeth, teeth. But the clear cube though is pretty cool. I like the clear cube with the yellow dots. That's pretty awesome. So and let's check out this uh, the sleeves here. So this is contains sixty five. Ooh, sixty five sleeves instead. That's kind of nice. I do play Digimon a lot, so I do like to use the sleeves. 
from all over but let's see how these sleeves are and see if they're like battle styles oh they are like battle style sleeves uh, again, I compare it to Battle Styles, because Battle Styles is what I came into when I first did Pokemon. So, it's, it's what I came into, it's what I, it's, it's my, uh, it's my control, where I know, and this is my, my base, it's just where I really refer to for everything. And these do feel really nice, and so, using these as actual, um, card sleeves for, for, for Pokemon, I actually wouldn't mind, and just 65 sleeves too, so. That's pretty nice. If I open up another one of these and then I use one for a deck for uh for Digimon, but for now, we'll keep it to the side. That's pretty awesome. Alright, we'll put everything to the side. Um I'll put this to the side. I definitely don't want to see any of these. Uh these dividers we'll put in there, but let's get to opening these packs though. And let's see what we can get. Yo, alright, so um oh, I got two packs. One pack only, one pack at a time. Um, oh, okay, that one came off pretty easily. All right, so with these uh, celebrations pack, it seems like the uh, the first two cards or three cards are the cards that are kind of common, and the card you want to get is like the third card. So there's four cards. It should be Lugia, Groudon. This one should be the Chase card, but it's not just the Volatile. So we didn't get anything in this one. We get ooh Lunala. So this is a card that I actually wanted to get. So <laughs> for me, that is a hit for me. So awesome. It was a card that I haven't seen yet. And now I have straight into the sleeve. Uh, man, again, I haven't been able to get um any uh top loaders just because I haven't go been going to any little stores at all. And I've never seen anything, so yeah, I have to go out there and find it so I can find anything. Um, all right, so uh, we'll do the first card. You can see the first cards because we know these cards are all the common cards. Palkia, let me see this guy. We got Groudon. Oh, yo, check that out! Yo, this card is crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. I mean, we got Veshram, okay? So, from this angle, no Veshram, but from this angle, we don't know what we got. It's all like, yo, it's crazy. Yo, it's ETBs, man. That's, that's where the hits are. ETBs. And are these textured? They look like they're textured. From the phone, I can't really see if they're textured or not. Um, I can't see all the ripples because all the glitter effects are kind of blocking it. But I am touching it. Oh, you can see a little bit here. You can see a little bit of all the textures. Yeah, it's definitely texturized. I just gave it a little bit of my oils. But yo, check that out. And by we got Professor's Research and then Code Card for y'all. Yo, that was truly, truly awesome. This ETB phenomenal. Let's see if we can get more pulls. Umbreon Star, but damn. I actually wouldn't mind if my, my nephew opened this up. He got this card here. He would have flipped out on how amazing the card looks. The card like this, the aestheticness of this card. I talked about it in the last video when I opened up the uh, Dark Sylveon. I was talking about that, and then I remember I was talking about my nephew and how he got that Umbium Star. He was like, ah, oh, okay, I got, I got, I got an evolved EV for him. And he's kind of just kind of like, oh, I'm gonna put this side of the other, you know, holographic rares. But see, if he pulled something like this, he would have flipped because of how crazy it is. And then I, I opened up a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh stuff, and then I did recall, um, I was saying that the more stuff you see that curves the picture, the more I guess value the card is. The more the better off it is because then you know when you can't see what it is that's that's how you know it's a it's a pretty good card because you know you have to do a different angles to see the card for what it is because here you really can't make out what it is you know it's rushing around but you can't really see the details until you go here and you go oh okay i can see a clear picture of it very odd but that's very awesome though yo we got a hit there that is pretty dope i'm glad we opened up this box oh man E trainer boxes are probably where all the magic happens. And we got white code cards, so um we know that already. What in the world is going on with this one here? Um okay, let me open this one up. So we know we, we know we got maybe something here. Are all these white code cards? Hmm. I think they all are, no matter what. They're all white code cards. So let's just flip this to the front. You know we got Yavelto. Right, we got we got the common ones. We got Kyogre comes and back. We got ooh, we got Garchomp C level. 
uh, either 10 or X. Yo, <laughs> this is a pretty awesome pack. Yo, the ETBs, that's where they're at. That's where it's at. The magic happens in ETBs, always. Level up, put it onto Garchomp C. <laughs> this is sick. Another card, not as cool as the Reshiram over here, but still very awesome though. Still very cool. Reshiram here is pretty awesome too, but this one, ooh, all the rainbows that's around it, the border. I got Lunula again. All right, cool. We got two of those now. Cool card. All right, so uh, the first one was a the Lunula. Lunula. Uh, that one wasn't much of a hit, but these ones here, though, oh, these are glistening. Each one of these are glistening. That is, that is, that's too cool, man. These uh, celebration packs, if you can get the elite trainer boxes, that, that's where it's at, yo. Elite trainer boxes for these. Alright, so let's open up this one here. We got a Reshiram. Let's see if we can get anything out of this one. Ooh, let's go Shiny Magikarp. Alright, we got a Palkia. We get anything. And I did, did, did say that, you know, it's a different one when the uh, Awakening Twice Baked Jake. He did mention that, you now the older card set, the, uh, like say, you know, the the first, not the first edition, but the first set, uh, you know, the base set Charizard, you know, Venus Sword, Blast Wars, those older set cards, their borders are a little bit darker. Um, I wish I had the other cards to compare it to, but I don't. So this one's not one of those cards, so it's just a Dialga. Uh, we didn't get anything in these ones. Yeah. Is this Professor Research? Is that a bit older? Maybe. I can't tell. I can't tell if this one's older or not. But we didn't get anything in this one. That's a bummer, but it's okay. We got some pretty cool hits right there. Let's see if we can get anything in this one. This is a uh, pack number five, I believe. Pack number five. So some odd reason these packs are opening up really, really awkward. But it's okay though. This way you don't know what's in the front. In the front we have Bam! Another Palkia. So we have plenty of Palkias. Um and then we have Ho Ho. Do we get anything back there? Hmm. It's not a Third one should be the hit card, but I don't think we got anything here. Uh oh, we got a Xerneas, exactly. And we got a, the Pikachu. Hey, it's that Pikachu, the full art for the uh, the first, uh, I guess, Pikachu. The Pikachu in the woods. That's what I'm going to call this one. Pikachu in the woods. Yeah. Chonky, chonky guy. Put that guy back there. I believe we have one of them already. I do need to get the birthday Pikachu. I haven't got any of those yet. So that's one of them that has one of the cards that I do need to get. Oh, come on. Okay. So odd. All right, I'm gonna just take it out this way. All right, that was really weird. Sure. All right, we got a Kyogre. All right, we got a Kyogre. And then we got a Growlithon. And, ooh, we got it here. Got Cosmoem. Okay, this is the one that I was saying that I didn't have yet. It's because I have the Cosmog, not the Cosmoem. Cool, and we got the Surfing Pikachu. All right, so we got two that um, I believe we haven't seen yet. Um, this Cosmoem. This is one that I was saying that I don't have. Um, but the Surfing Pikachu, I don't think I have this guy either. So that's yeah, Surfing Pikachu and Cosmoem. So I'm sleeping these guys because I haven't had these yet. So I want to make sure that these ones do get sleeved. Um, as soon as they can be. <laughs> All right, I'll unpack them. All right, so this rip doesn't work. Man, it's not consistent. Oh, gosh. I just don't open these packs. I found a trick with Digimon, but I have not found a trick with Pokemon. Maybe because the packs are always all different, but I just... I do want to be kind of gentle with these cards. I don't want to scuff them up too much either. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty bad with them already, but... I want to be worse on them. Groudon. We got a Cosmog one. I said we got it already. I'm getting it back. Oh, do we get something? Is the bordering here is a little bit different? I can't tell. Oh, it is. It's textured. Yo, we got something. <laughs> all right. So you can definitely tell that this one here, maybe it's because of Nintendo. Um, are these all Nintendos? Yeah, these all have the Nintendo uh, logo at the bottom there. This one here does not, so we definitely got something. What did we get? Oh, we got the birthday 
Pikachu. So the one that I was saying I needed. Cool. So there is a difference and definitely a texture. The whole card is textured. So that is pretty dope. Oh man, the fill in that card is pretty nice. Oh, we got two hits. Yo, we got Professor Research too, a full art. That's sick. We got two hits in one pack. Man, that's pretty been awesome, yo. These chances that, yeah, man, these lead train boxes, that's where all the magic is, dude. Ah, oh, sad to say, if you can get your hands on these lead train boxes, that's, that's, that's where it's at. I actually wanted to get my hands on the um, premium collector's box, but that one there, that one has a gold uh, Pikachu and gold Charizard in it. I'm both I can show in a picture over here somewhere if I can find a picture of the uh, gold plated cards. But that one there, though, oh, if I can get my hands on that one, that would be amazing. Um, but I don't know. I've been looking and searching. Just cannot find it anywhere. Oh, okay. Ooh, I feel like that one tore terrible. I shouldn't do that again. I feel like that one ripped up really bad. Because this is Charizard. <laughs> I'll be sad. Well, if you're going with the uh, Umbrium Star. We got Zekrom. And we got the Cosmoan. Try it again. Try oh, we didn't get anything. We do see the same thing. Oh, darn it. Xerneas. In the back, we got a. Ooh, we got a Mew. Oh, I think we got this Mew already, but not the other. We're, we're looking for the gold Mew. I believe there's two Mew in this one. I do like how the tail is spiraling in, though. Right, right, right into the star there. So that's pretty dope. Ooh, cool card for you. That's pretty dope. And the last two packs. Can we get anything from these last two packs? Okay, open up nicely. Open up the top here instead. Open, open. Okay, we'll just do it this way. So that way it's nicely you can pull these out. Oh wait. Oh. I just saw a cold card. So used to pulling cold cards. I right, got a Kyogre. Again, this Kyogre is pretty awesome. The two uh I'm gonna say there's trainers, so that's pretty cool. Got a ho o -Oh in the back. Ooh, we didn't get anything, but we got the Lugia. Looks dirty. Why do you look so dirty, Lugia? In back we got a Pikachu, the same uh one that's in the forest. So those are now one. Let's see the last pack. Can we get anything in the last pack? Last pack magic. Um for the celebration. We still have some other packs we need to open up and chill rain and very voltage. But let's see if we can get anything from this pack here. All right, so we got Xerneas. We got a ho -Oh, and then you get back. Ooh, did we get anything? Ooh, we got another texture. What did we get? What did we get? Ooh, Venusaur. Venusaur. Venusaur! Oh, ooh. No Venusaur. We got Rockets Admin. Okay. Old card. <laughs> Team Rocket card there. That's pretty cool. That's interesting. All right, so we got a different card. And we got a Zacian V in the back. So these are pretty common cards too, but a code card there. Pretty common cards. Um, yeah. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We'll put this card back there. Um, Zacian go down there. There's two locker ones though. It's gotta go up though. Oh, that one's pretty bent. Let's get a, uh, a different one. A different sleeve. Um, Okay, let's put you in here. Sleeved up. All right. Behind Professor's research. And you, don't block that shit, remember? Sham needs to shine. Needs to shine. Cool. So those are the uh, packs from uh, the celebrations. That, I'm actually pretty happy. Out of 10 packs, one, two, three, four, five. Half of them were, were hits for me. I mean, these ones could be hits as well, too. You know, the flying, these certain Pikachu and whatnot. But I think Pikachu's are pretty common in these. Birthday Pikachu is a little bit more uh, uncommon. But these guys, though, wowzers, wowzers. All right, let's go through uh, these packs as they came to me in order. Um, no, not in order, but as they came out of the box, though. Chillerine, Chillerine. You got the... Uh, uh, Ice Rider Kyle X, and we got the, uh, the Articuno. Is it Glaring? I think it's Glaring or not. And we got the Beetle here for Vivid Voltage. I don't know much about Vivid Voltage at all. And we got another Ice Rider, another, um, Articuno. So let's open these packs up and let's see if we can find any forts. And yeah, I don't know open these packs up. Packs are all going to be open this way. 
the power move up all the packs. I don't know if I'm them up. Uh, let's do... Oh, oh, we saw the cold card already. No, we got nothing in this one. Kind of sad. One, two, three. And let's just go through these. Now, let's go. We got a uh, single strike scroll of piercing. Uh, we got Avery. Oh, that's right. It's coming back to me now. Thoraki, rapid strike. Shuppet, single strike. That one's all by himself. Cup full. This one's pretty cool. Blitzel all by himself on the ice. Burgundy two, rapid strike. We got Crowfish, single strike. Ooh, we got a Glare and Slowpoke dipping his tail into the water. And we got a Vindipede. Uh, reverse Hollow. In the back, we got a Slurpuff. As you were. And then we have a um, Fighting Engine. So, no hits there. Boo hoo. So pretty sad. Oh, why did that one rip off so easily? Man, I just. I don't know. So inconsistent with this. Is this from the bottom? Yes, it is. Code card. And here we go. One, two, three. To the front. And we got a Glaring chest plate. We got a Catalan. Oh, the Kakuna. Single strike. This is the one that was doing the command. The uh, Kelkin charge. The Shuppet. Single strike. Cub Fu. We got a Blitzo. Rapid strike. We got a Crowfish. Single strike. I don't know this is the exact same one we pulled. Glaring so full. I got the Reverse Hollow. And the back we got a uh, Serene. Non holographic rare. And a Fire Energy. So. No hits out of those two, pretty bad. Um, kind of what Chilling Rain is. Chilling Rain is kind of like Battle Styles, really bad pull rates on those. Um, a lot of packs are just, you know, a lot of nothing, a lot of duds. So, yeah, that's why the, uh, the set was hurting just as bad as Battle Styles. Just as bad. Now, is Vivochu down here? Yes, it is. The code cards are all still the same still. Three to the front. You keep that energy in the back. All right, I have a little bit much video voltage, so let's go through this. Galvantula. We got a Swallow. Ooh, that's cool. League Staff. Awesome. Juto. Juto. <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> He's just barking at someone. We got Raulu. We got a Chimko. Yarn like. Nikita by himself. Voltorb looking like the same artwork as Nikita back there. Yan Mega. This is a. I always thought this was a Mega level card, a, Mega, a V Max uh, Pokemon, but it's not though. Yeah, this is a Reverse Hollow Rare. And in fact, we got Yo. <laughs> Check that out. We got a flipping Full Art Secret Rare Full Art one ninety seven out one eighty five, and this one's a. Uh, a uh, Metal Energy. Yo, check that out, dude. This is the Elite Trainer Box. This is the luck that they bring you. The luck that they have with these pulls. So check that out. Yo. Secret Rare. It's an old lady, which is kind of weird. But, you know, it's cool, though. It's a full art. Dope, dope, dope. Let's cover a picture up a little bit. No, we'll put him right here. I'll put her right there. Between Professor Zoke, oh, don't put Professor Zoke's face though. Let his face show a little bit. All right, so, dope, dude, we got a hit there. Man, that was pretty awesome. Um, all right, let's see if luck can continue. I mean, I I'm pretty happy enough already with this box. I mean, if you don't get anything else, I'm all right. You know, I, I got some good hits from the celebration packs. I got great, I got a good hit from Vita Voltage, which I haven't op opened up much of those at all. So that's really good. Rap boot single strike. We got a rapid scroll. Rapid strike scroll. Scroll of the skies. Let's do that over again. Rapid strike scroll. Scroll <laughs> of the skies. Goodness. Uh, we got a Curlia. We got a Furfro. We got a Larvesta. We got a Diglett rapid strike. We got an NK rapid strike. We got a Rock Ruff single strike. Ooh, Cabalion. Uh, the rare ho reverse holographic. Cabal in here looks pretty awesome. It looks like, dude, the uh, Cabal in looks like it's uh, drawn into like it's on like, some some part of like planet Earth. Like the, whatever it's standing on, it looks like it's actually a photograph that was taken. And they just kind of drew on Cabal in. If they drew this too, man, that looks really detailed. It almost looks real. In the back, oh, we got nothing here. We got a Lauren. Uh, no hot graphic rare, and we got a water energy. So, no hits in these chili rain packs, which is pretty, you know, standard for, you know, chili rain. Oh man, see, these packs are inconsistent. 
I don't know, open up super easily. How about the back here? Oh, dang. I just ripped it off. Okay, I'm too strong for the packs, apparently. They don't want to open up the way that, you know, they're supposed to open up, so. Anyway, we'll just open up this way. I feel more confident in my ability to open up the packs that way. More, cons more consistent. Um, and then we do, oops, oops, cards all over the place. One, two, three. Hopefully it didn't damage anything. All right, we got a Justice, Justified Gloves. Lucky Energy. We got a Porygon 2. We got a Ghastly. We got a Cup Fu. We got a Hatena. We got a Sobble Rapid Strike. And we got a Boom Sweet. Again, you know, I'm going through these cards pretty fast, but if you haven't seen these cards yet, you're like, hey, slow down. Cause that's how I was when I first saw these guys open these packs. I'm like, why are you going through the cards so fast? Like, let me look up the artwork first. If you want to check it out, I'll put in a video on the top right here. You know, hopefully it's there. You can check the video where I first opened up, uh, you know, the, um, I think I did, I think I did a, uh, booster box? If not a booster box, I did a Elite, Elite Trainer box, but I know for sure I opened up some packs for, for Chili Rain. Boom Sweet. And we got a Spiel as the reverse holographic. And back we got a Bomb Snow non-holographic rare single strike. So... And leaf energy. So that's how dead Chili Rain is. Chili Rain is really hard. There's just no luck in them at all. It's kind of like a battle style. You get a bunch of those packs and you get nothing. Nothing. That's why the values on those packs are going down every day. So anyway, we got some amazing hits. I mean, these here, you know, these are the hits from Celebrations. You know, They're not really amazing hits, but it's what I would consider a hit. If I give this to some kid, you know, and then they're still going to do it, they would flip out. They were flipped out. They got these four cards. They go, yo, what are these? They're all holographic and shiny. That's how amazing celebrations are. Just every single one of these cards are all holographic, you know, just to see it shiny. Just to shine. That's what kids want, the shine. So, uh, again, let's go over the ones that I think are really awesome, have texture, the ones that I actually would go for. Opal, this is the one I just got from the, the Voltage one here. Professor's Research. This one's really cool. The full art here. I actually like this one here. The trainer. This one was odd, but we pulled it. This one here, Retro Ram. Oh, I'm glad I pulled this one. Um, I actually just did like this one. I actually wouldn't mind getting the Zekrom 2 now. That's pretty dope. We got the Birthday Pikachu. This one that I am chasing after. One of the ones I'm currently looking for. And Garchomp. Let's see, so cool, cool, cool. Um, overall, man, this is a great set, you know, and then. Take a look. These are all the cards. I actually might just give these away to my nieces and nephews and just, you know, people who I know who are collecting. Just because, you know, this set here has so many awesome cards. Each one of these cards is holographic, right? You know, see holographic rare. Each one of these, Xerneas, Pikachu, right? All holographic. Lugia, right? Hello, gang. Kyogre. Kyogre here, I think it's super awesome. I'm surprised this one is not like a highly sought after card, but really cool card, but... Oh, is that a uh look at the white line across there? That might be an error right there. Oh, that might be an error in the card pack. Let's look through all the cards because so Mew doesn't have it, but the Mew is also uh you know they're all they're all holographic cards though, you know. Zekrom is too. Uh the same with this one here on the right side. There's like a big old scar right there on a the cosmog. Really unfortunate, but you know, to a kid though, they wouldn't care, man. These kids my niece, my, my nephews who collect these, you know, they just shove all these cards into a box and go, oh, yep, cards are all there, but all right. So, uh, yeah, the other Kyogre, yeah, definitely had a, a imperfection in the art, because let's go back to that Kyogre um, here. So here, you can see at the top there, right above, you know, this guy's head and his muscle, right on the fin here, a Kyogre going across, big old white line across there. I mean, I can see it because I have the lights on it. This one here, nothing. So some of the cards are, you know, not perfect. And so it's just a okay. You know, this is the fact that these cards are all holographic. And for some kids, we got these cards. They go, wow, we got a holographic card. Yeah, great gift, great Christmas gift. You can get this for Christmas and give to, you know, a kid who loves clicking Pokemon cards. They would be ecstatic to have these cards. Hello, I'm going too long now. Um, yeah, this is my unboxing of uh, the Lee Trainer Box for um, Celebrations. I'm digging it. I, I'm, I'm going to look forward to opening these, the one from the Pokemon Center. Because that's one that actually is branded and it has the 
uh, Pokemon Center logo, I think, on the whole box. I had never really opened up a, you know, stamped um, Pokemon Center uh, box before, but I'd love to. And I'd love to see the actual, you know, pull it on those. But box feels nice. This is actually going to be a nice card, a nice box to keep around. Yeah, a nice, nice showcase card uh, box, too. And it's cool that all the textures are all, you know, holographic back there, and you can go and shine onto it. You can see all the different you know, Pokemon on there, which is pretty cool. Anyway, I'm going too long. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.